One, two, three, four. Yeah, go! Hey everyone, I'm Nano Elite 666 and you're watching me play Doom Eternal The Ancient Gods Part 1. We are back. Here in these here blood swamps where we are looking for the Father's Life Sphere. So that we may either retrieve it, as was the uh, initial reason I came out here. At the behest of one. At the behest of one, uh. Sir! Sir! Would you cut that out? At the behest of one, uh. Samuel Hayden, who is also, uh, apparently the Seraphim who's like God's big right-hand man or some shit. Surprise, surprise. I have set myself on fire. Wrong button. Give me... So, allegedly, I'm out here to retrieve this life sphere of God. Because we want to bring God back. Or something. But my uh, mission objective thing says to destroy the Father's life sphere. And our. Our. Uh, our, our arc intern guy is very confused as to why it says that. I am sort of confused as well. But I guess we'll just have to figure out. Ah, uh, you. F Pop goes the Mancubus. Red suit. So, fun fact, ladies and gentlemen. I can breathe in this water. Book of the Seraphs, Part 5. It came to be known by the Seraphs that the increasing failings of Jakad troubled the father as he looked upon its spreading tortures and horrors. It was the first realm he knowingly created, and it was still beloved by him. But he came to understand that his whisper of mortality to their long-lived souls drove them mad, and he knew the infection of jealousy in their hearts for the immortal in Erdak. Devoth's grasp for power bent the walls between realms. His growing hordes defeated many deputies and lesser gods the father created. As they were absorbed by Davoth, his strength grew far beyond what the father placed in him. The father bids Samur, his most trusted, to help the father in his final undertakings in the physical realm. The father would confront Davoth and Jakkad, and after this, the father would withdraw from the physical realm. Samur would then be tasked with taking the father's life sphere to be stored safely in the Luminarium. Should the father perceive any rising dangers from Jakkad, Samur would be called to bring the father's life sphere to a place that none could find it. Samur swore obedience, though he knew it would come at great cost, for the makers would hunt Samur as a heretic. Heretic! 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 Shut up! <laughs> Wait, wrong game. Anyways. Oh, is that suit not going to respawn for me? Do I have to find... a recharge on my own? The answer is yes. So how come I can breathe in this water with just a rad suit, but in that other water at the UAC sea base, I had to have a different type of suit to breathe in the water? I do not know! Oh! 
and then his bottom just came apart. Good old super shotgun. Tee hee 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 Kill 20 demons that are on fire with the super shotgun. Hey, look at that. I'm full on armor. How nice. Extra lives. We need those, that's for sure. Please do not explode on me exploding plant things. Open sesame! Oh! Was an incubus there. <laughs> he dead now. Anyways. How do we get over there? Uh-oh. I hear small children in my house, ladies and gentlemen. I might have to take a break for a moment. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, we are back. Sorry, I had to visit with my brother and his kids because they swung by for a little bit. I had to entertain my nephews. Anyways, what were we doing? Doom guy things. I want to get over there somehow question is, I probably just have to, uh, okay, there's just a pathway through the floor there. question is, yeah, see, I didn't think that was standable, but I didn't look very well at it. I found a secret! Hey, look, it's one of them rune things. Alright, we got blood punch deals, double damage. That actually might be useful to have. If a demon makes me burn an extra life, kill it real quick to get the extra life back. That, uh, look at that one. And equip that one. Blood punch dealing double damage sounds nice. But given how we have seen... My uh, performance and lack of lives so far in this DLC here. Being able to get some extra lives back as I burn them is... Uh, That's the key that opens the entrance to the Father's Tomb, which, according to our data, should be on the crest of a mountain just beyond this altar. That is the origin of the Father's Realm. Being able to not burn all my extra lives... Uh, you're a dead sentinel. Sounds like a very useful thing to have. All right. Uh, there's a little zombie pukes down there. All right, so this is... Oh, no, there's a... Oh, okay, jump across there. I don't think there's any other goodies up here I need to worry about because I'm about to jump down and go ha ha and probably not get back up. There's a boss fight in the middle of there. That'll be fun. Yeah, definitely. Definitely gonna pick things up then. Which I don't need because I've already picked everything up. Alright, what kind of mess is this gonna be? Not a boss fight yet. I have two places to go. Which way do I want to go? That's another giant dead thing. Oh, 
itself. Edit that sneeze. I'm occasionally bad at not doing that. Alright, what do we have to deal with? Oh, it just died. Kinda wanted to glory kill it. But whatever, it's dead. Guys, what are you doing? Like they heard the sound of fighting and said, Oh, we want to do that too. It's like a basil juice from Monster Hunter. If basil juice was a sad, shambly zombie thing. That was very easily killed. Very easily killed by just smashing its head into its torso. <laughs> the fuck was that? life up there. I'll take that, thank you. Did I just pick up health when I didn't need it? Yes, but also picking up health fuels my blood punch! Buff totem. Well, let's see. Where could it possibly be? I'm going to go over this way. Buffed Marauder? No, thank you. Four health is a very small number, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, this... this is not... Mm. Life back, I did. I see what you made me do, game. You made me kill the Marauder so before I could take out the totem. That is dastardly. Dastardly and unpleasant. On the bright side, hey, you know that thing I got that, that I said, ah, you know, I should grab this so I don't burn through so many lives? It turned out to be quite useful. Anyways, am I stuck in here now? Probably not. I just have to find my way out. Another extra life over there somewhere. Here we go. That's something I could climb on. Okay. 
Okay. A spirit can possess demons, making them tougher. When a possessed demon is killed, the spirit moves and becomes exposed, and then it's vulnerable to the microwave beam. That sounds pleasant. Oh my god, this is the worst. Two health is a very small number, ladies and gentlemen. Alright, I can already tell those are going to be annoying to deal with. Come here, you. I actually hit him, but that wouldn't be the first time that uh, the game has been generous with me hitting things that I didn't actually hit. Alright, spirits, those sound fun. And by fun I mean, uh, I don't like the sound of that at all. Alright, so I need to make a box there. I know I saw a box around somewhere. Boom! Yeah, that's how I went in. What's empowered in Arachnatron? That's easy to deal with. enough to deal with. I don't like it here. It's all foggy and shit and hard to see. That's water. the hell night and the imp ow okay smash that yet. Well, this is just regular non-toxic water. I can breathe in it for some reason. Curse this inconsistency with Doomguy's ability or lack thereof to breathe underwater.
All right, so what did that let me do? So I would get that extra life. Oh, so you gotta go climbing. Or not yet. I have to get a box over there. Question is, where is this box? Knowing me, I'm missing something incredibly obvious. The scenery does not go splort. Ha! Who's missling me? He's dead. Okay. Guys, what you doing? Going to smithereens. Look at how fast and far that one went, just with a single punch. You know, I know I've complained about how sometimes Doom Guy punches things, they don't seem to go very far. It's not so much that, it's just that Doom Guy always knows just how hard he has to punch something to make it go where he wants. He's a mathematician like that. Or maybe that would be physics. Physics is math. Math is physics! Everything! There are no physics in space! Disappointment. Oh, hello. What do we have here? Ah, armor. Okay. I say that's a pickup I've never seen, but then I was like, what did it do? Oh, wait. My armor gauge went up. This looks fun. There were dudes there. I believe that's an Arachnotron in there. Would your turret please just... Oh no, you're possessed by a spirit, that's why. Okay. Don't you do that bullshit. That's a specter. There are multiple invisible pinkies. All right, come here, you. Hmm, everybody just... Go back this way. Eat that, you some bitch. Fuck. 
fuck are you all? Missiles incoming. Great. It's a Doom Hunter. Did that run out? It did run out. Almost. What just smacked me in the side of the face? Oh my god. Swamp's bad for Ed. Don't blow ammo with this bullshit. Yes, critical damage. Now you have critical damage. Now you're dead. Oh, fuck you. Why do I want to chainsaw one of you sons of bitches? It's like, now nah, we're just all gonna die. Anyway. Swampy place bad for Ed. Ugh, that was annoying. That is a nice idea. Alright, so I gotta switch to punch. Excuse me, will I glitch out of the scenery? Hello, big ol' armor pickup. Alright, that's nice. There'll be a secret fight in there. It's not very secret, it's just kind of hanging out there. fling myself over that way now. But, before we do any of that, ladies and gentlemen, I do believe it is a good point time to wrap it up for this part. Because I think it might be about that time. I don't know, I had the, the interruption from family visiting for a wee bit, uh, and I just kind of left everything running while I was AFK. So I don't know where I'm at, actually, with <laughs> time on the video. But it seems like a good place to place to wrap it up for this part so we'll do that so once again i thank you all for watching i hope you've been enjoying as always if you have any suggestions or recommendations for games that you think i should play that might make for a good series like this at some point in the future or if you just wish to give me a shout give me some feedback i'm doing am i doing good am i doing bad I'm doing bad what can i go to do from doing bad do from good do good from doing good those were words that came out in some semblance of a coherent sentence it wasn't a very good one but i tried not very well or if you just wish to inform me that I'm a terrible person because that wasn't a very good coherent sentence I just made, you may inform me of such in the comment box below. PC, PS4, and Switch for recording suggestions. That is all that I can currently record on right now. And as always, if you enjoyed this video and want to see more like it, then please subscribe to the channel. Or you'll be kept up to date whenever I post up new videos, and then you won't ever have to miss out on any of the shenanigans that go down in this my little corner of the internet. Also, if you know of anyone else who might enjoy watching this sort of thing, Please share this video or one of my other videos with them. Put them in my general direction so maybe they might potentially swing by and be entertained by the shenanigans that go down in this my little corner of the internet. Also, you should follow me on Twitter at NinoElite666 as I will be using that to make news updates and announcements and such regarding the channel whenever the need should arise in the future. Anyways, ladies and gentlemen, once again, I thank you all for watching. I hope you've been enjoying. I'm NinoElite666 and I will see you all next time.